My name is Matt Eason. I'm one of the personal injury attorneys here at Eason and Tamarini. And in this video, I want to discuss whether or not you should hire an attorney or not if you've been involved in a car accident, truck accident, or something like that. And no, the answer is not going to be absolutely, because that's not true at all. It really depends on your risk tolerance and the particular case. By analogy, a few weekends ago, a friend of mine decided to cut, out, cut down a bunch of trees on my property. And I had not cut down trees in 20 years and hadn't operated a chainsaw in probably the same time period. So we got onto YouTube, watched a few YouTube videos on how to do it, and we went up and did it. However, I have to qualify that we cut down all the small trees and the trees that were furthest away from the structure. The larger trees that were by the structure and or by power lines, we ran from like the plague. Those are the kind of trees that are professionally best to handle. And a personal injury case is much the same way. So the question then becomes, well, what is the dollar number that you should have an attorney handle versus yourself? And quite frankly, that depends on you as a consumer. What a dollar means to you versus a dollar means to the next person could be dramatically different. However, I would generally say that if the value of your claim is going to be more than three or four times your monthly salary, then that's the claim that you ought to get some professional assistance to help you out with to make sure that you get every last penny out of that claim. What's a lawyer going to do that you can't do? A lot, and in particular on the bigger claims. Understanding the value of a claim and how to maximize the value of a claim is not just a science, it's an art. It takes lots of years of experiences with juries and judges to understand what they're going to think when they look at the facts of your case and what they think the value might be. Though that kind of experience is invaluable and that's what an attorney can bring to the equation. Besides case valuation though, there's a lot more that goes into the equation. There's a case law out there called Howell versus Hamilton Meets that talks about dealing with the medical bills and how much medical bills that you get to put on as evidence because that has an impact in the value of your case. And if you don't have a thorough understanding of Howell versus Hamilton Meets, you could be significantly harming your case. In addition to understanding what evidence can go in, there's a great question of, well, who do you have to pay out of the settlement when you do settle the case? If you had health insurance, most of your health insurance providers are going to hold their hand out saying, we want to be compensated for the money that we paid on your behalf. And there's some authority out there that talks about what you have to pay and what you don't have to pay. Under some collection cases, you don't have to pay a single penny back to those health care providers. Under other situations, you may have to pay it in full or you may be able to reduce it. Is your health care governed by ERISA? Were there other provisions for medical payment in the policies? Was there an uninsured or underinsured claim? Those type of issues become complicated and that's where a lawyer can add a tremendous amount of value. So the short answer is no, not every case you need an attorney. But I think that if you have a case that's got a value of maybe three or four times your monthly salary, you're definitely getting into that area where you certainly should have an attorney. And even then, if the case is worth less than that, a lot of times you'll still find yourself being grateful that you did hire an attorney. If you've got questions whether or not an attorney is right for you, for your case, we'd be happy to give you a free consultation. We'll go over the facts and circumstances of your case, and I'll answer the question bluntly and directly at the end of the conversation as to what's the benefit of hiring me or not. My name again is Matt Eason. I'm a personal injury attorney here in Sacramento at the law firm of Eason and Tamarini. You can reach me at 12348 Street, Sacramento, California, 95814. My email is matthew at capcitylaw.com and my phone number is 916-438-1819. Thanks for listening.